Good morning. Welcome to the channel. This is Arctic Fox Studios. So this is the first in uh, hopefully a long series where we provide a whole bunch of free patches for various plugins, VSTs, and effects. And as you may have guessed, today's segment is for the new synth from Dawson called Abyss. Uh, this is very cool. I first saw this plugin Friday night after seeing a Venus Theory short that was less than about a minute long. And I immediately knew I was probably going to buy this thing. Uh, it's very cool. Uh, there's a link to Venus Theory and his video. And uh, there's also one here for Marula Music. Uh, he did a review also. And uh, you can get this right now under a free trial for 90 days so that's pretty darn generous and uh, it does have a um, pop-up box that comes up every once in a while that you got to click uh, but other than that there's uh, no other controls on it and you basically can create and save your own patches and uh, use it in your work if it's less than about 10 minutes long so i'm going to do a separate video on this uh, in the next few weeks uh, today is just going to be a overview of the free stuff so you can get a feel for how this thing sounds and see what some of the LFOs, envelopes, etc. can do. At the right, you're going to see a list of the patches that uh, we are providing today. So there's a total of 25 patches. And uh, if you like, jump ahead and go ahead and listen to any one that you want. So one of the first things that I noticed uh, with this VST is that it's got a lot of really great patches. Uh, you can see here that a ton of pads and drones, which is really what this thing is built for, um, some synths. But when you load it up, it already has a patch set up. And so there's no blank patch to start with. Uh, if you want to start with a blank patch, you have to actually go in here hit initialize all the sliders and then if you double click on the sounds they go away and that pretty much will get you your free patch however in the arctic fox library uh, we give you a blank patch to start off with that's got nothing set up so basically everything is leveled out and uh, you can just basically listen to some of these sounds you hit shift and do a drag and drop and boom there you go you're all set up to start one of the other free patches or two free patches that we all have also included is a filter sweep which as the name implies is basically just a low pass filter on the cutoff and then there is also a back and forth pan uh, kind of a tremolo effect almost and you can get rid of any of these real quickly if you click on the pan and then hold the shift and double click you'll get rid of basically all of the uh, uh, connections to that control and then finally the third is a ASDR envelope that's set up on uh, the cutoff I believe let's see if we drag something in here on the cutoff and the position basically or sorry the level and the position so as you can see if you link on here it shows you that first ASDR curve is set up on the position and the second one is set up on the level so those are just some patches to help you get started to make your own patches so the rest of the video we're going to go through uh, the additional list of patches and there's 25 patches here that you can get started with so i'm going to stop talking and you can start listening and uh here we go <laughs> Thank you. 
So that's pretty much it. Check out Abyss on the Traction website. It's a great looking and a great sounding plugin as well. Uh, I'm having a ton of fun with it, and most importantly, it's pretty inspiring. Uh, it's really a different take on synthesis, almost like a wavetable synth, but um, with more a focus on listening to the sound rather than you know looking at a moving waveform on the screen. Uh, I'll probably do a full review of it soon because I do have some constructive criticisms um, and a list of uh, features that I think would really make this thing uh, go toe-to-toe -to -toe with some of the higher tier VSTs out there. So let me know in the comments if you like the video, what your favorite patch is, and if you get some use out of these, hit the buy me a coffee link in the description. So that's it for today, and we will see you on the other side of the mountain.